Hi, folks. So good to see this event happen in person. Um, hi, my name is Al Seifer, and I lead the Federal Public Sector Public Policy Team at Amazon Web Services. Thank you so much for the opportunity to come chat with you today. AWS has sponsored the Congressional App Challenge for the last six years. That's most of the years it's existed. Uh, we've seen the growth of the program and the massive amount of support from congressional uh, offices really increase year over year. It's now over 335 members, and that's really crucial to the access and development of the challenge and, the, and your, your ability to, to participate. Encouraging students to develop their coding skills and pursue careers in computer science is something that is a central goal at AWS and one that we support through sponsoring programs like the Congressional App Challenge. We also partner with educational institutions to make cloud and technical training available more broadly. We're excited to be here because the App Challenge exemplifies exactly why cloud can be a catalyst for innovation in districts across America. AWS is the world's most competitive and broadly adopted cloud. We offer more over 200 fully featured services in data centers across the globe. Millions of customers, including the fastest growing startups, largest enterprises, and leading government agencies are using AWS to lower costs, become more agile, and innovate faster. It's been really cool to watch some of the YouTube videos of y'all's uh, um, explanations of your apps. And when, when you do the tech track and you explain where your code is and how you're hosting it and what, what services you're using, it's really wonderful to see what part of the tech stack you're leveraging and how the different uh, SaaS solutions you're using, different code and no code platforms. It, it, it's been really wonderful to see. Um, at Amazon, we're committed to supporting and developing educational initiatives that enable all kinds of STEM learning. Programs that we support try and target learners at all levels with different opportunities to access. This means we're making many of our tools free and available to the general public. We also partner with universities who are looking to advance their technology offerings specifically as it relates to training in cloud. AWS has committed to investing hundreds of millions of dollars to provide free cloud training computer skills to 29 million people by 2025. Our goal is to reach folks from all walks of life and all levels of knowledge in more than 200 countries and territories. Since 2020, we've already helped 13 million folks get access to cloud skills. Though from the looks of it, and like I said, I clicked around. Um, I'm originally from Arizona. I went ahead and just opened every single app from Arizona. Anyone from Arizona in the audience? No? All right. <laughs> tried. Um, and they were, they were really, really wonderful. Some, some wonderful climate change, uh, some, some health and safety applications. They were, they were so cool. Uh, here uh, in Arlington, Virginia, we at AWS opened an AWS Skills Center, home to Amazon uh, in Arlington, Virginia, which is where our second headquarters is located. This is a free space open five days a week where anyone can walk in and start learning about cloud. Having said that, like I said, your app's really good. <laughs> Keep going. We're excited to continue increasing access to cloud skills and make it easier for people to access the skills they need to grow their careers. We see all these initiatives as critical to helping prepare and engage students, as well as those looking to develop new skills, because we know that's the best way to foster growth and innovation in our field in the coming years. You all know that already since you've, be uh, since you've begun uh, your journeys in different parts of the, uh, the application development system, how much things have changed just in the last six to 12 months. Now imagine that throughout the course of the entirety of your educational path. Thank you for giving AWS the AWS the opportunity to speak with you today. I want to once again congratulate all the winners and participants. These apps are incredible, and so is your work in embrace of technology to solve real-world problems in your communities. Great job.